What is up, beautiful people? I'm over at the store bright and early. I'm going to go over to the bin store. I'm a little bit later than what I wanted to be. Um, so I'm going to head over there. Give me five. I think is the name of the store. It's in Dalton. It's about 40 minutes away. I'm way later than what I wanted to be, but it'd be like that sometime. So let's go get some binning done. All right, initially when I first pulled up, there was a line. I didn't really understand how the process worked. So it ended up with me not getting in the first group and I was a little upset about it, <laughs> but you know, I guess it'd be like that sometime. All right, so I finally got in and I just started going through the bins. Um, I wasn't, I'm not very good with the camera in the bin store yet, so I apologize for the angles, but uh, I went through and I just started digging through, trying to find stuff that I could find. Um, I don't really have a process for doing this because, like I said, this is literally my second time kind of digging through the bins and finding stuff. But I did find quite a bit of stuff. As you can see inside of my bag, I've already got a bag full of stuff because I want to focus when I first got in there. I didn't want to think about uh, filming. Um, so uh, here in just a minute, we'll go over to the side and we'll look at some of the items. You probably won't be able to see um as much on the screen as i would like you to see but uh when we get to the end of this video so make sure you stay to the end of the video because me and april are going to sit down and go through each and every item and uh what we think we can sell the items for um so yeah i'm just digging through the beans that's that's the name of the game let's get the digging All right, I can't see everything that I got, but I, this is the first thing that I kind of picked up. It caught my eye because it's obviously it's an electronic. I like electronics. Um, and I was trying to scan everything. My phone's acting weird. Um, it, I just did an update on the iPhone. It's, uh, they want us to buy a new one, and I ain't doing it. <laughs> um, so this one was going for, I believe, about $48 once I get around to find the barcode and scan it on a couple different platforms. Um, but it was going for about $48. Eight dollars, and I want to make sure that it was still, you know, good in the pack. And they do have this place right here. It's called Gimme Five. It's in Dalton, Georgia. They have a bunch of them. Uh, I think in Kentucky and in Tennessee. Uh, I'm sorry, in Kentucky and in Georgia. Um, but they're like kind of like a franchise. So if you have one in your state, uh, make sure you go try to check them out. Um, but they do have like test stations, so you can kind of sit down and go over. Um, you know what you bought and you can also plug things in they have uh, receptacles there so you can plug stuff in to test stuff um, they also will help you with opening boxes and opening packages and things like that so it's really good if you want to go in and get some some quick inventory uh, for not a lot of money um, so I picked up this little um, blow dryer blow dryers do well in our store we pretty much sell every one that we've gotten um, so as long as it's at least $25, that'd be good because it'd be cheap to ship. And then plus if we sell it in the store, we can make $15, which would be 
three times the money I spent for it. So everything this day was five dollars. I guess I should have sold, said that at the beginning of the video, but I didn't. Um, everything in the store today is five dollars today and tomorrow is five dollars, three dollars the next day, um, two dollars, one dollar, and then a quarter um, for the day after that. So, all right, this was a uh, a Shield Marvel Shield DVD set. It wasn't worth it. It was like nine dollars. So uh, I ended up putting that back. So right now I'm kind of going in between apps. I'm going between Amazon and eBay. So if it's an Amazon item, a lot of these are Amazon items. Um, you may have to type your item in. So what I do is I type in exactly verbatim what's on the little sticker. Um, sometimes they give you like an XX number or something like that. You can't find anything with that number. So you have to type in um, the title. And a lot of times you can't find it exactly with that title because that's what's going to be on the Amazon listing of the title. So that was a uh, retractable um, dog leash. So it was at least $25. And so I kept it. I didn't spend too much time trying to look at the items or look at the um, prices on the items because, you know, it, for the price of $5, if I didn't get a good one and then I found a couple of really good ones, then it's going to make up for the ones maybe that aren't so good. So when you're in there, you kind of got to make quick decisions, but you do have time. It's, there is no rush because you can literally sit there and go through your stuff on the floor. All right. So this was probably one of the bigger items that I got and I, I haven't went in and priced it 100% yet, but I did find some that were comparable and the price was really good. We'll show you that, like I said, here at the end of the video. All right, the last thing I looked at right here was this little VTech um, wireless monitor. I think it's like a, just a voice monitor thing. Um, and I think it was at least $25, so I believe I kept that. I can't remember exactly, to be honest with you. <laughs> so it's gonna be a mystery to me if, if I did keep that as well. So we're gonna go back and we're gonna dig through, dig through the bins a little bit and then you can join me in the truck. So that was uh that was a little um, interesting. <laughs> that's the that's the word I'm gonna I'm gonna use for it is interesting. Um, so they had a really good setup. Um, I wish I hadn't gave up my spot in line. So what had happened was I didn't I forgot that you were supposed to get a ticket. So I was standing in line and I had to go out get out of line and go get a ticket. But that allowed the couple in front of me um, to be in front of me to get a ticket, which is you know which was fine. And then uh, I didn't realize that when I went to the back, I thought they was gonna go by ticket number, which they did kind of, um, but <laughs> I let somebody in front of me. And when I let them in front of me, actually that that was the last person of the group, the first group that went in. So 
essentially I gave my spot up in line and I wasn't able to get in the first group. So I had to stand out there for maybe an additional 20 or so minutes, which wasn't bad. The only thing about it is if there were some really good stuff like first and you know i kind of missed that on that but i think i got some pretty good stuff i got didn't get as much as i thought i was going to get i got um 11 items so it was 55 dollars so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go over to the other bin store where i've got all my equipment and uh i'm just out going binning today so i'm gonna go over to the other bin store see if i can get a couple more items i'm striving for about 25 items is kind of what i wanted to get today so um yeah let's go over to the other bin store All right, I will admit that I got here pretty late. It was about 1030. Um, so they had been open for two and a half hours at this point. And the bins were very like they were empty. Um, but I went through and I started looking for some stuff. So that's one of the thing about going to a bin store is that you're not going to have a lot of people that do the same thing that you do. Um, so we sell some stuff on Amazon and we sell stuff on eBay. We sell when we also have a store. So some of the items aren't going to be desirable for people because they may not necessarily know how to sell those. And a lot of the people that go to these bin stores aren't necessarily looking to sell things. Um, you know, they're just looking for stuff for themselves. You know, they can get a really cheap price. So don't think that you have to get there super early in the morning just to get the best deals because you may still find some stuff so i found this little um keyboard uh, it's like a little piano i think we can get at least ten dollars for it i didn't I, I couldn't find it i sat down on the floor um here in just a minute and i kind of looked through things and i tried to find mostly everything and i think i found some really good stuff and i actually some of the stuff that i did throw in my bag i threw back because it wasn't um, worth it I didn't film too much in this store, but I will tell you this menstrual pain reliever thing. It's an electronic device, and it was looked like, for me, it looked like it was selling for big bucks. So we'll have to see once I get to the house if this is going to be the major win. So I got to the second spot a little bit late, so there wasn't as much stuff. It was definitely... Um picked over <laughs> um but i think i got some pretty pretty decent stuff i didn't um i didn't dwell too too long i just i was trying to stick to about 10 items uh so i got 21 items total i spent 112 dollars total with tax and uh so we're gonna go over to the house and see what we got hopefully we did did pretty good all right i finally made it home let's go in and see what we've got Hello, ants. All right, so we have got all of our stuff here. April's going to help me. Right, because I have no idea what we got. <laughs> it's a mystery, April, because she's been it at work is. all day. So. I know. <laughs> I went and grabbed everything. She trusted me enough to get everything. I did. So uh, let's go ahead and start. What we'll do, we'll just show everything first, then we'll cut, and then we'll get all the prices and stuff. And then, uh, Sounds good. then we'll go. All right, first thing, we've seen this item like 15 times. We try right. to get all the cameras right. <laughs> this is a uh, dual retractable dog leash um, sealed new. Yeah. So if we can send this into Amazon, we can send it in because it's brand new, sealed, it's easy to ship. And uh, if not, we can sell it on eBay at least. Yeah. I would say. All right, the next thing is that. There Revlon. Is that who it is? I can't see. Uh, Treasure May. There it is, yeah. Treasure May. And it looks like a Walmart sticker. Pretty yeah. sure it is a Walmart yeah. sticker. But it's actually, I believe, it's maybe sealed. I think this that just came off the code. Yeah, because either side is sealed. Yeah, it's sealed. So this is new, so we shouldn't have to test it or anything. Hope not. And uh 
Oh, the good thing about that place, April, I went to Gimme Five. The Dalton one. The Dalton. Okay. One. You can. They have like little test center, so you can take stuff out the package and plug it in and all oh, that okay. stuff. So that's pretty good. Yeah, and then plus it's where everybody can save a dollar. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Next, another sealed item. That is sealed. a DIY. I can't read it. Miniature House. house. I can't read upside mm. down. So anytime I see anything that's new, sealed with a barcode. Yeah. I mean that's like one hundred percent what I like to get. Yeah, so if you can send that in, <laughs> that will be pretty awesome. If not, we will sell it on eBay and or somewhere. Uh, Facebook marketplace, which has turned out to be a really good place to yeah. sell, sell stuff. Especially like online. And I don't know or if you shipping. guys I say I don't know if you guys know, but I know um if you guys know but Facebook right now is doing free shipping. They're offering free shipping on select categories. I know toys is one of them. Yeah. So you don't have to pay for shipping and your customer don't have to pay for shipping. Awesome deals sound like to me. Yep. What is that? I don't know. It's a dead, game. <laughs> dead of winter. That's what it is. So this one I saw, there was two of them. Somebody had the other one. They picked up the other one, but I saw this one. It was sealed. So like I said, anything new and sealed, I like it. So and all of this one came from give me five look give me five give, give me, me give, give me, me five. five okay yeah all right so this is kind of an easy no. little thing is a usb-c power adapter apple yeah. sealed so they're right there go all day long on uh, ebay yeah we've sold like three of them yeah they're thing that big no that's it okay we got one more bag from give me five All right, next. Magnetic blocks. That's what I think we, we had remember we had those mag things we got in the baby palette. You okay. remember those uh they was like yellow? Kinda sort of, but not really. <laughs> <laughs> they gave in the baby palette. We had them in the front of the store, and then we had like six or seven to eight of them. Okay. And then we sold them for like thirty something dollars a piece. That's why I got this. Oh really? Okay. Yeah. Well, this is this, this different brand, same concept. Okay. So. Well, we'll see. We'll see if that's that goes. Good, good item. We got us another sealed item. Love sealed items. High quality embroidery thread. So. I think this is a good item. Here. Oh, well, I scanned. I didn't scan it because you can't scan it, but I looked. And this is one of the items that I was like, when I looked at it, I'm like, is this right? Is this the right thing? Because there's no way that um, that price is what I saw. Oh, <laughs> really? Okay, yeah. so I'm Don't, you can't look it up yet. <laughs> We're going to do it at the end. He won't let you. Yeah, he I'm won't. hiding it. He won't even let me, he won't even let me look at it. Uh-uh. She's going to be trying to list it. I will. Mid video. But, all right. This is a talking pen. Okay. I don't know how it works. I don't either. But I guess it's got like books. So like Peyton used to have one of them where you can scan over it and then it'll say the word. Oh, okay. It's like a toy. It's okay. a cute toy. But it's sealed. I just like new sealed electronic. Yep. Can't beat that. $5. All right. Next is Revolution over the ear Bluetooth headphones. Now, I was able to look these up in the store. Okay. There was, I saw two of them. One of them was open. This one was open, this but it's new. Yeah. It's still new on the inside, so I think it's good. Just ask. Siri and Google Voice Assistant. So, I think those are pretty good. Oh. I'll probably keep that. <laughs> it's a 100, 128 uh, gigabyte um, SanDisk card. Yep. He always need that because mm. he always out of out of memory or corrupting. Something. Yeah. All right, so we got so many of these. I don't know what that is. So this is a six pack. The reason I got this one is it's a peel planner, and each one of these was about eleven dollars a piece. Okay, and so you six pay pack. Five, and you don't pay five. I pay five dollars for yeah. the whole pack. So that's so. and then brand new. And they have Amazon listed for these, I okay. saw. So, but they may go for more on eBay individually. Okay. So we'll, we'll look at whenever we start looking at stuff. Okay. So that's everything in from Give Me Five. And that's the last Give Me Five box. So the next, uh, the next box. So when I went to which I saw, but when I went to the second uh, Ben store, which is Treasure 
Um, Lakeside Treasure Lake Hunt. Lakeside Tre- Treasure Hunt. They already opened at 8, so I didn't get there to like 10.30. So all the good stuff, obviously, was gone. It's, it's picked over. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so. We're going to try to make it back after tomorrow. Yeah, we're going to try to make it in the morning. I, I don't think that line will be as long as Gimme Five's, because Gimme Five today was their fifth anniversary. Oh, okay. Or fifth birthday is what and they call it. we would choose the one day. Right. Out of all the years, all the days in the year, I go on the day that they're having like this special. So you actually got one free item. Oh, okay. So. And thanks, Heather, uh, from the group for telling me that. Because she told me. Oh, okay. That they, it was their birthday. They print off the thing. So this oh. is an Eve case DSLR um, little pack. Camera bag. Yeah, like a little camera bag. Yeah. So it's new, sealed. We'll see what that goes for. All right. Well, we have a multifunctional handy. Why is it called a handy? <laughs> Audio and video. Oh, okay, it's for your cell phone. So I couldn't find that one online, the, this particular one. Mm-hmm. But I found some that was similar. Okay. So hopefully this is probably a good Facebook marketplace. I'm thinking shipping. Okay. Shipping item because somebody's just gonna look for that specific specific thing. All right, and we got us some uh, mouse traps. Sealed. We yeah. actually had some of these before. Um, I think I got it at the bin store last time. When, the very first time I went, mm-hmm. and then I just went there, just got a couple items. It seemed like I got a pack of these mouse traps. Mm-hmm. So these are sealed and new, so it's a 10 pack. They should go for more than $5. I would think. We should see. We have a super slim drive portable USB 3.0 interface drive. There you have it. So it's an electrical component. I think electrical components there always do pretty good. Um, it's a it's a DVD burner drive. Oh, is that what that is? So it's portable though. So like, uh, what this is my thought process. Okay. So people that have computers, like I got a Mac computer. It doesn't have a CD drive. Okay. But I may want to burn a disc. So how do you do it? Oh, you cool. use one of these so you okay. can, you plug this into your MacBook or your um, laptop that don't have a CD whatever. drive and burn yeah. a, a CD or yeah, a DVD. Yeah, mine doesn't have one either. See? My laptop doesn't. So you even need that. Yeah. All right. What is this? A wooden block. <laughs> <laughs> a universal knife block. Oh, okay. It's an extra slot for scissors and sharpening. So I don't really know really what this function, what, what it is. I'm assuming that these, they have like little slits at the top. Yeah, you can so put knife. any knife in there. Yes, yeah, it's a knife block. Knife block, okay. So So if you don't, it don't have the knives to go with it. So. No. So I think we should be getting more than $5 for it, I yeah. would say. I would say. Oh, I hope so. All right. We have a. Ooh. That right there is a ooh la la item. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> this is a caribou. It's sealed. It is sealed. Menstrual nursing instrument. So it's an electronic. Electronics are always wonderful. Yeah. And I was able to find something similar. It's got a barcode on the back. When you go into the bin store, that's one of the big things is, is not having barcodes. Yeah. If you can't find the item, just type in exactly what's on this little you see sticker. Has, yeah, it's got yeah. like a little sticker here. So you can type in that title right there. Normally you can find it. Um and then also if it had starts with the B a Bravo, you can go to Camel, Camel, Camel and type that in and it'll pull up the pricing history of it. Okay. So that's just two kind of ways you can do it. But this one I was able to find just with the, uh, with the course, name. And of course, he's not going to tell me how much it costs. Uh-uh. He, he, I'm he, putting he, it over to the side. He's taking it away. I can't even look at it. See how you do it? We got many items left. What else we got in here? We got another sealed item. Mm-hmm. I don't know why I got this one. Like that pink flamingo. Well, I was calling to him. I felt like this would go for more than five dollars, even if it's not like selling online. But it's a, it is a little piano, uh, okay. like a little kid piano. So I think Christmas time it'll go good. Yeah. You can get at least ten dollars for that with your double your money. Yeah. But I think it's gonna go for more than that because yeah. it's got like a little microphone. Okay. Um, and you can do like keyboard set and. Just whatever. Yeah. I don't know what age group is for. Let's see what the age group is for. 36 months plus. Okay. So it's like a baby baby. Yeah. But still. You gotta go good. All right. We got a... Is this the same thing? Two yes. Two of the two same. So this is a full HD webcam. That's what it looked like. We got two of them. Mm-hmm. Uh, this, this one is open, so I'll take it out so you can see what it looked like. That's it. Yeah, and it, I think it just clips. Let me see. I think... I'm pretty sure... 
it just clips some kind of way to your existing computer so you can probably put it on top of your laptop mm -hmm. and then you can have you know this webcam so it'd be really good for people doing like zoom calls yeah. now and they're doing like online learning and some computers don't have webcams so um this one is still new i believe it's just open box yeah and then this one right here it has never been taken out the box so yeah, this was like it. it. See, I don't have a bag. No. But so I think we sh should be able to get more than five dollars for those. I would say. <laughs> All right, and that's the last item in it. It is, and everybody gonna need this for their temperature yeah. gauging. So here is a non-contact infrared th uh, thermometer. Now, I don't know if we can sell these because it's a, like a COVID item yeah. or whatever. But I may, we'll just keep it if yeah. I can. Because, I mean, who doesn't need an infrared thermometer? Right. You know. And these, these day and times. Right. <laughs> All right. So, we are going to go through and tally everything. We'll count how many items we got. I think we got 21 items. I'm pretty sure is what I calculated. Okay. 21 items. $5 per item. We paid 50 It was $57 at the first uh, place to give me five. And it was $54 at um, Lakeside, Lakeside Treasure, Treasure Hunt. Got it. So um, $112 all in. 21 items. Let's see if we're going to make some money. Yeah. All right. all right. We're back. We are back. So after we counted everything, we had multiple of those pill Bottle, bottle holder thingies okay so we had like six of those so they brought our um our cost per unit down to four dollars and 67 cents not that big of a difference from five dollars but it accounts for some of the tax so mm -hmm. that's pretty good so our potential what we should make on everything is 493 dollars 89 cents we paid 112 dollars for everything um so we should profit about 381 dollars so I think that's pretty good. Yeah, and then we also had a couple things that we didn't list. Yeah. Like I'm gonna keep this uh, SD card because I'll use this for the uh, GoPro or Just camera or something. Uh, I haven't tested this yet, so we didn't include that in the price. Um, no. But they're going for about twenty three dollars. Um, it looks new, but it was open. It's kind of got a banged up box, so I want right. to definitely test that one out. And the Super Slim drive. I believe it works. Yeah. Um, but I'm gonna do some further testing. I don't wanna I'm gonna make sure it works before I before list it. But these it. these are going for about twenty five dollars too. Okay, so yeah, those are not listed in, in the price and the headphones. And the headphones. The with the headphones they weren't weren't charged up, so I got them charging right now. Um but they had like a little bit of a rattle. I probably should check yeah. that out before I left the store, but I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I was stressed. What y'all want me to do? <laughs> so yeah, so those are not included. Mm -hmm. Um but everything else, we pretty much, listen, we did good. We got to list it. You'll be real proud of us. <laughs> we got everything listed except for those few items that mm -hmm. still need to be tested or just, you know, whatever. Um, so I think we did pretty good. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. What do y'all think? Do y'all think that we did, like, good? I hope so. I hope I did good. Right. I let, I let TJ go by himself. So, mm. we'll, we'll so see. see, next time we got to be a team. We got to be a team because right. Saber will be off on one side and I'll be on the other side and they'll give me, like, the look like, TJ, we getting that for? And then right. I'll put it back. <laughs> 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 so... I think we did pretty good, mm -hmm. you know, for this to be our second time doing the bins. Mm -hmm. So, so I'm liking doing the bins because you get, I mean, you get a lot of inventory. If you don't have inventory um, and you want to get some more inventory up, mm -hmm. or even if you are just a new seller and you don't know how to do this, I mean, you can literally take twenty dollars and you can get four items. Yeah. And you list turn, those and turn that maybe into a hundred dollars, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, I mean, because like if you take four, you know, four items here, like this, this right here is like selling for what twenty five, twenty dollars. Mm -hmm. This, um, that let me show you what it is. That is, um, selling for like twenty bucks on eBay. Mm -hmm. Uh, you probably sell it on Facebook Marketplace. So if you like intimidated by eBay, you can mm. just listen on Facebook. Yep, and I think the biggest winner was. All right, sorry. <laughs> this is that was actually the biggest win. It's the Caribou um, Menstrual Nursing Instrument. It was ninety nine dollars mm -hmm. um, on Amazon. It's yeah. brand new, sealed, never been opened. So that was actually a pretty decent find. There was this other thing. This was like forty something dollars. I think it was forty. 
46 yeah 46 dollars so this was like the next in line for good items mm -hmm. and the third thing was and i think we ended up finding it finding it was this right here so when i was in the store i found one of these on amazon and it was a two-pack okay and a two-pack was like 144 dollars right <laughs> right and it's selling on amazon for about 43 50 dollars so right. um I don't know. We just have to find somewhere to to sell it. Yeah. So we're gonna put it on we're gonna put the put this one on eBay. Okay. For right now I think that's that's the, the plan. Yeah. So but overall I think we did think we did Pretty well. Good. Yeah. Alright, so if you like these types of videos, please like, share, and subscribe. Really appreciate it. Also hit that bell icon so you get notifications whenever we release new videos. And we've got um probably another one of these next week. We mm -hmm. got a vlog that's gonna come out tomorrow. Today is Saturday. So I, right. I always say that, and then I know people watch videos like on different days. Right. But I always assume that you're watching it on the same day that we put it out. So I'm <laughs> st I'm trying to stop doing that because when I say tomorrow, there's there's no relevance for tomorrow because right, whenever you watch this video, it I could mean, be a month from now. Exactly. <laughs> so, but you should see a new video soon. Right. In the next from video. whenever whenever you're watching this video, it right. should be a new video coming should out see, soon. You should see a new one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See y'all. Peace.